From the technology capital of the world, this is Silicon Valley Business This Week. Coming up on this week's edition, can General Magic conjure up success at last by aiming at the internet? We'll take a look at the company's new game plan. Why are these people standing in line? Well, the answer could help the bottom line in a major Silicon Valley company. We'll show you what one company is doing with technology that provides a television quality picture on a very thin device. And we'll sit down for a one-on-one -on -one talk with Kirk Pond, who stuck around through the turmoil at National Semiconductor and wound up with his own company to run. Welcome to Silicon Valley Business This Week, the only program completely devoted to Silicon Valley financial news. Fred Lacoste is away this week. I'm Stan Bunger. You know, the Internet changes just about everything. And this week, General Magic set out to reposition itself as an Internet software company. This might be a case of trying to pull a rabbit out of a hat for General Magic, which has stumbled while trying to build a business out of software for handheld, pen-based computers. But now the company sees an opportunity in the incredible explosion of the Internet. On the one hand, we've got this, this personal communicator, uh, this platform technology, and on the other hand, this incredibly rich set of services, this whole marketplace of information and ideas. What do you do with them? Well, obviously, you've got to put them together. So General Magic is rolling out Internet products in a hurry. There's server software and also a way to use those handheld communicators to send and receive Internet email and browse the web. General Magic remains committed to agents, software which can search the web and help deal with Internet anxiety. I have to invest the time, the time, to keep banging on the web with my mouse and my keyboard because unless I do that, nothing happens. The web is passive. From a human point of view, that creates anxiety because I know that if I don't invest the time something critical could be going on out there either in a, in a business context or personal and I'm missing it. The agent concept comes to life in third-party software like this news search tool from Farcast which keeps an eye out for information you want and then delivers it to you via email. General Magic stock which has been in the tank for months showed little reaction to this week's announcement ending the week at six and five-eighths.